every single achievement in World of War Zombies, let's go. Now unfortunately, achievements for zombies did not begin until Shinonuma. And just a double slap in the face, it was only on Xbox and PlayStation, so you could not get any Steam achievements. But that is not going to stop me from getting every single one, so let's jump right into Shinonuma. Now in Shinonuma, there are going to be 10 achievements that you can get. Well, technically 9, and one of them is a hidden achievement, but we'll get to that when we get to it. So I thought the first achievement I should go after would probably be one of the more annoying ones, and that's going to be called Hammer Time. Repair 200 window boards in a single game. I knew you could probably get this one done fairly early, but because there's no achievements popping up because I'm playing on PC, I have to manually count. I have to do math. Cringe. So I have to keep track of every board that I rebuild, or I would never know when I actually did it, so... Yay me. So to start the game off, we buy the Arasaka, and my goal is to just let the zombies in as much as possible, kill them all, run around, rebuild all the barriers, and just keep doing that. And while I was working on the Hammer Time achievement, I was able to get another one that I thought would take a lot longer to get, and that is Weapon of Minor Destruction. Kill no more than one zombie with a nuke. I thought this one would be a lot harder to get because it really comes down to luck. You have to get a nuke at the end of the round. But my luck proved to be stronger than my zombie skills, which isn't saying much because I don't have that many. And I ended up getting a nuke towards the end of the round, so I just run around real quick, kill all the zombies that I see until there's only one left, grab the nuke, and achievement get. <laughs> So now back to doing math and the hammer time achievement. I decide to open up the map a little bit. I keep hitting the box. Maybe it'll give me something good. Maybe it'll just give me an FG42. Who knows? And I also want to try to get Jug because I didn't want to die uh, like an asshole. Watch your profanity. So of course my luck streak continues. The first perk that I open up is of course Jug. I grab it and I continue just hitting the box and rebuilding barriers. And eventually once we got to the end of round nine, I finally crossed the 200 window board repair list and we got the achievement. The next achievement I want to get was going to be the hidden achievement, and in my opinion, one of the more easier ones to get, and it's going to be called Dead Air. Must have been a wrong number, and to get this achievement, all you have to do is activate the musical easter egg, The One. Now let me tell you, back in the day, okay, for me and my fellow boomers, this easter egg was the shit. Nowadays, you can do an easter egg and you can like, get naked and mud wrestle God with giant space monsters in space. Like, that's the achievements and the easter eggs you do nowadays. Back in the day, we had telephone music easter egg, okay? It was not as well known as it is nowadays, okay? So this easter egg was the tits back in the day. So once we activate the music easter egg of the one, we successfully grabbed this achievement. And because I'm an idiot and I was trying to grab some more perks, and I ended up grabbing uh, the most useful perk, Quick Revive, because in case you didn't know, in World of War, it's super useful solo because it does absolutely nothing. I ended up kind of getting cornered back here in this hut, and my genius thought was, I'll buy the BAR that'll save me the bar and zombies is known to be good and i ended up uh kids cover your ears getting butt fucked by the dogs so we had to restart you suck you jackass so as i start up a new game i thought the next one we should probably go for is going to be called perkaholic have all four perks simultaneously active in a game of nazi zombies this is one of the more easier ones to get. All you have to do is just play the game. And by the end of round 10, I was successfully able to grab all four perks and collect this achievement. And while I'm doing all these other achievements, secretly in the background, I'm working on two of them. One is called Fertilizer Man, kill 200 zombies in a single game. And the other one is called Deadhead, get 150 zombie headshots in a single game. So while I'm doing all these other achievements, I'm working on this one. And because I'm just such a zombie pro, I decided to do a tactical restart. And I ended up timing it exactly at 200 kills. So exactly as I died right here in this clip, I was able to complete the achievement Fertilizer Man and get my next run started. Now that is what I call expert zombie skill. And there's very few people out there that could probably do what I just did. Right. 
So after my tactical restart, I started a new match and I just play around. And my whole goal from the start was headshots, headshots, headshots. And after I grabbed the Browning, it just made headshots and lining them all up so much easier. And by round 13, we were able to successfully complete Deadhead by getting 150 headshots. And because we're on round 13, we're very close to completing a, another achievement, Soul Survivor. Reach round 15 in Nazi Zombies without getting revived. And if you're playing solo, the second you hit 15, you're going to get this achievement. So congratulations, you made it to round 15. Such a high round. Wow, many good. I'm proud of you. I'm coming home with the milk, son. Good job. The next achievement I decide to grab is going to be called It's a Trap. Kill at least one zombie with three different traps in a single round. And this one's kind of easy and kind of not, because if you're playing solo, only 24 zombies spawn in per round on Shinonuma. So if you use an entire horde through a trap, well, you're not going to get it. So you really kind of have to activate the traps so that way you don't kill the entire horde of zombies. You want to leave some left for the next trap, and that can be a little bit difficult. But after two electric traps and one giant spinning wheel of death, I was able to successfully grab this achievement. <laughs> The next achievement turned out to be a lot harder than I thought because it is called Big Baller. Get 75,000 points in a single Nazi Zombies game. And I spent so many rounds just point whoring it up. I would grab the Thompson and just train them all up and just tried to whore up as many points as humanly possible. And here was the thing. I didn't know how many points I had total. There wasn't going to be an achievement that told me, hey, you did it. So I knew I had spent money to open doors and perks, but I wasn't sure how many. So I really wanted to make sure that my points in the bottom right said 75,000. So that way I could at least prove to you guys that I did it. And with as little box hitting as I could possibly get and a little help from the PPSH, at round 33, thanks to a little bit help from some windows, we were able to successfully breach the 75,000 mark. And this achievement I thought was going to be a lot easier, but it turned out to be more of a pain in the ass than any of the others. And the last one after a handy dandy restart is going to be called Big Brawler. Get 10 consecutive zombie melee kills before an instant kill expires. This one was kind of tricky because sometimes we got an instant kill at the end of the round and there was only like seven zombies because you have to remember only 24 zombies are going to spawn in per round on solo. So if you get an insta kill, you want to make sure it's towards the beginning of the round before you've killed almost everyone. But eventually, the zombie gods bestowed upon me an insta kill, and I was able to get 10 melee kills right off the bat. So we were able to successfully complete our last and final one, Big Brawler. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is all of the achievements in Shinanuma. I am a zombie god. Let's move on to Doris. Okay. Oh, I feel like I will throw up. A mere side effect, Russia. Everything oh. is normal. Let's get this done. Now, moving on to Duris. Duris also has 10 achievements very similar to Shinanuma. The first one I thought I should go after is going to be called Dur Electrician. Link all the teleporter pads before round seven. As long as you're smart, you know, unlike me, you can get this done very, very easily. All you have to do is just play the map and point whore a little bit more than you usually would and uh don't spam your money on the box maybe hit it like once or twice to get a point weapon but you can get this done very easily don't buy any perks yet you're only going to be on round five because that's how long it took me to complete this one i was able to successfully pretty much open up the entire map and get everything linked and pack a punch ready by round five and you can too with today's sponsor i'm just playing Gotcha, gotcha. But after I successfully got that achievement, the next one I wanted to get was the 40 knives one. This one is kill 40 zombies using the Bowie knife. You have to get this one done very early on because as you know, after round 10, you're going to be taking two knives and World of War zombies were not all cute and cuddly as they appear to be. Because once they hit you, they're going to stop you in their tracks and then more zombies are going to pile on. And it's going to be like you're a kid at a Minecraft YouTuber meetup. It's not going to end well for you. So luckily on the dog round, I ended up grabbing the Bowie knife and started meleeing. But because I'm an idiot and I crave death, sometimes a little too much, I ended up going down trying to melee a zombie, so I had to restart. So after restarting and a little help from the M1 Grand, I was able to successfully kill 40 zombies using the Bowie knife and complete that achievement. <laughs> And immediately right after that, we were able to complete Whacker Packer, upgrade any weapon using the Pack-a-Punch machine. And I felt like, hey, we have the M1, 
it carried me to victory thus far. Let's upgrade it. So we upgraded the M1 just for shits and giggles. And then since I have the upgraded M1, that kind of led me directly into the next achievement, elevate your senses, activate the fly trap. This is the main Easter egg of Darice, and it doesn't say complete it or anything. It just says activate it. So all you have to do is get an upgraded weapon and shoot right here and then bam, you got the achievement. You don't have to complete it. You just have to activate it. So the next achievement I want to get is called Locksmith, and this is open all the doors in the map. And I pretty much had already had almost all the doors open at this point because there's not really that many on Darice. The only one I didn't have open is the one next to the Bettys and Juggernaug coming from the trench gun way. So I just ran over there real quick and I opened it up and yay, more gamer points for me. My wife is going to be so excited when I tell her. But now that we have all the easy achievements out of the way, now we can kind of get to more of the annoying ones. The next one we're going to be going after is called the Might of the Monkey. And for this one, you just have to use the monkey bomb. But the trick here, you see, is getting it. Sometimes the box no likey you. I was able to get the Wonder Waff first because that is so helpful on Darice. Let me tell you, Wonder Waff and Jug make for a very overpowered combination. But eventually, after 17 rounds, we were able to successfully get the Monkey Bomb and the second I got it, I threw one out and got this achievement. And that kind of leads us into the next achievement that we can get and that is acquire Waffle Weapons. Obtain the Ray Gun, Wonder Waff DG2, and the Monkey Bomb at the same time. We already have two out of three. We just need the ray gun. And after many rounds of point horning and me having to give up the goddamn PPSH for this, you don't know the kind of suffering I had to go through to get you guys this video. I had to give up the PPSH. We were able to grab the ray gun from the mystery box and complete the achievement, acquire awful weapons. And piggybacking right off of that, early in the game, we've upgraded the M1 Grand, the Type 100, and the Wonder Wolf. That is three upgraded weapons. We only need Two more to go to complete the Packed Attic achievement. Upgrade five weapons in the same game using the Pack Punch Machine. Oh, I forgot to mention, while I was upgrading the Wonder Waff, I almost died trying to upgrade the Thompson. So that's technically four weapons that we upgraded. So all I had to do was upgrade the Ray Gun and bam, Packed Attic is officially done. You could definitely get this one done a lot easier, but I wasted so much money trying to get the Ray Gun, Wonder Waff, and Monkey Bomb combination that... Majority of my points this game just went straight to the mystery box. Now, the second to last achievement that I had was Frequent Flyer. Use the teleporter eight times. Now, here's the thing. Here's where I messed up. I accidentally, totally accidental, shocked myself with the Wonder Waff. Therefore, Jug doesn't really work. And I was desperately wanting to get this achievement done, and I just didn't have any points, and... It was a race against time before I eventually mess it up and die. But luckily, through every ounce of skill that I had, we were able to teleport, run to a new location, teleport again, run to a new location, and somehow barely get enough points to keep doing that until we successfully had teleported eight times to acquire the Frequent Flyer achievement. Now, the last achievement in Darius is definitely, in my opinion, one of the more harder ones, and that is called Perk Aholics Anonymous. Survive until round 20 without buying a single perk. That means no jug, cowboy. That means no quick revive, double tap, old speed cola. You got to get to round 20 without any of those. Can you do it? No, no, I couldn't. So I asked Tim to help me. And uh, this is how well it went. So Tim, I have not told you what we're doing today, have I? No, you have not. Do you know about achievements? Oh god. Oh god, please tell me this is not an Achievement Hunter video. <laughs> there is an achievement called Perkaholics Anonymous. Okay. And you have to get to round 20 without buying any perks. What a! <laughs> yep, and that's what we're doing. Dude, that's hard! <laughs> it's actually harder than people may think. Especially with these zombies, bro. They're so glitchy. Listen. They, like, stick to you. With the hey. power of friendship. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll do it. We got it. It's not going to be easy, though, for sure. Not at all. That's why I didn't want to do it solo. <laughs> I don't think there's any other game more than World of War where I have died rep repeatedly before I ever even got Jug in the first place. So, <laughs> Like on World of War, it's either you're going to have a good game or you're just going to be like a total noob. There's no in between. Yeah, yeah you're going to die a slow, painful death. Well, let's think about it. Quick revive, not useful. Double tap, not really useful for being honest. Speed Cola could live without it. This is really just a no jug challenge. Pretty much. About it. Can we survive 20 rounds of World of War without jug? <laughs> I, 
What happens if we don't, by the way? We're just gonna keep going at this over and over again until we get this. I mean, I'm cool with it, dude. <laughs> I'm gonna we'll force see. you. We're gonna be here all night. No, I, I got a listen. I got a strat. I got a, I got an idea. Sit in the corner with an MG42. Kinda. I think I'm gonna go with the Thompson. Well, I'm just gonna go straight towards the box. Oh. I'm okay. one of those guys. Oh yeah, that's cool. No, no, that's all right. I see where we stand. Yeah. Stand right here next to the box. Oh, we can get Betty's though. Yeah. Bouncing Betty's was like the biggest meme in 2011 with me and my friends. <laughs> Bouncing Betty on this dirt. That's that's inappropriate, dude. This is a come on, it's Christian friendly. <laughs> This is a COD Zombies video. <laughs> this is Christian friendly, man. We're trying to be PG. I've turned over a new leaf. The old rabbit is no more. We're we're new and improved. Man, that's fucking boring, though. We respect all minorities. Religions. That's what's tough about YouTube, man. The more you are of yourself, the more you get punished. Pretty you're kind of just so f***ed up. <laughs> yeah. Like, if you really think about it. YouTube, the more you you are, the more we're going to kill you for it. It's not fresh and fruity, Rudy Tootie. You know, that's actually oh. uh, an, a, a thing at IHOP. It's called the Rudy Tootie Fresh and Fruity. What's that? Some gay ass fucking pancakes. I don't think I've ever been. Oh, no, I have maybe once or twice, but I don't go to IHOP very often. Denny's. Rudy Tootie Fresh and Fruity. Yeah, that sounds like a fucking pancake with like fruity petals in it. That's what I think of immediately when I hear that. Man, so I'm going to get an achievement for doing this if we uh, do it. Here's the thing, an imaginary achievement because they didn't have World of War achievements back in the day. Oh, Steam. are you fucking serious? Wait, no. they really don't, huh? No, it was only on Man. console. <laughs> oh, well. So Turns through out the, a console is superior after all. Through magic and uh, editing, we will make our dreams come true. Yeah, just make a shitty JPEG in the top right corner. <laughs> and she's unlocked. Do. Virginity broken. No, I don't lose my virginity because I don't lose. Well, hit me up with the MG PPSH. Something good. God. Damn it. Hey. What? I see dead people. Yeah, it's called zombies, dude. We're playing fucking Nazi <laughs> zombies. <laughs> Have you ever had a real paranormal experience? Don't uh, bullshit me. Real par- um, Have so you ever been genuinely scared? I can- Not a paranormal experience, but one time, this was back when I was living with my mom. Uh, okay. They went out of town, and it was just me and my dogs. And I was taking a poop, Ooh. and I could like I could have swore outside of the door, I heard like voices, and I didn't think it was like oh. ghosts, but I thought somebody was in the fucking house. Dude, that's and not boy enough. So I had that dilemma to like, do I wipe? Do I finish wiping and go out and see, or do I? <laughs> do I grab my gun first, or do I finish wiping my ass? I first? was like, which one do I do? Do I wipe and then get up, or do I just go and? So I eventually decided I'm going to wipe. I don't want to fight some dude with shit in my ass. Yeah, I feel like if I had to die, I'd rather die with a clean ass. God, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Have you ever had a Jeez. paranormal -y? I got to be honest. I don't think so. Because if I did, I, it would probably float right to the surface of my brain. I don't think I have. I don't know if I believe people who say that ghosts are real. But then again, I haven't experienced it, and I really don't want to, so... You know what? I won't judge. I've been to, like, some of the most haunted, supposedly haunted places in America, and I did everything they told me not to do. They're like, all right, now don't say this to the ghost, and don't touch his rocking chair, don't antagonize the demons, and I did all of that, and I've never once been haunted. Turn off the lights, uh, spin three times, look in the mirror. Biggie Smalls! Biggie Smalls! Biggie Smalls! <laughs> oh, I forgot I have monkeys. Man, that's racist. I'm just doing mean, what I, you do to me during my I didn't my mean videos. that kind. <laughs> oh my god. Get all double down. I'll go link the last one if you want to survive here. Yeah, I'll stay by the uh, the mainframe. You go link the last Thanks. teleporter. Thanks, buddy. Oh, wait, you hang can on. spend all the points. Am I, I'm poor. Hang on. Hang on, hang on. Let me uh, come over there and juice some points from you. He's my sugar daddy. Linker up. Well, I found the mystery box. We're already on round 11, eh? So we're, we're kind of halfway eh? there. Oh, look at you. Yeah, I just been sitting here spinning it. I ain't got shit. I've been getting wall weapons this entire goddamn time. Thought this would be a little harder. Ha! Oh, man. Speaking of harder. Oh, 
yeah. I'm gonna grab your cock. Okay, okay. all right. That's him. I just zoned out for a second. <laughs> I just zoned back in. I'm like, oh, yeah, all right. That makes sense. <laughs> Bro, come on. Aw, Can you it. not? God damn it. Like, I only hit it 12 times, and then you come here and... <laughs> You gotta roll up in here and get the goddamn teddy bear. God, oh, PPSH. Yay. Oh, well, good for you. I'm gonna pack punch this. Oh, no, no, no. Stop hitting me. Stop hitting me. Oh, keep hitting him. Yeah, hit him. Smack him. Smack his ass. Oh, get the nuke. Get the nuke. Call me a little no. fruitcake. No. Barucked was called. A, I just shot myself with dead with a ray gun. But the good news is um, I can cover you because I have the way gun. Why'd you go down with the way gun? Oh, damn it. I don't even know why I went over there. I just decided to walk into that corner. Maybe it's because I was instinctually trying to grab Jug. Yeah, you know what happens deep down in your loins. Yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. Revive me, I have the oh, way gun. I got enough! I got it! Oh, son of a bitch! I didn't have any, I didn't have any money. I blew it all on the box. Dude, I lost a fucking ray gun. Good! Makes you a better player. You don't need it. I need dog shit this game, dude. I mean, honestly, the regular killed me, so. I just fing shot her right at my feet and died. Like a fing idiot. Okay, I'll, I'll put us on, the back, on my back. It's alright, man. I'm like, uh. I'm like, uh, like the my UK Steve during Kirk. World War what? II. Oh. That's embarrassing. Well. <laughs> we, we running it back or? All right, Tim. So today's. <laughs> well, this is our first attempt trying to get to around first 20 without Jug. Attempt. I think we should just I should just stay right next to you. At all times. Yeah, if I leave you or you leave me, one of us might go down. Uh, that's cool, cause I uh, I ran over a couple of kids the other day on accident, and Shit. I'm going to court tomorrow, so you can stick right by me while I'm sitting <laughs> All there. Right, I do not know you. <laughs> you were going to jail. You could be my eyewitness. <laughs> yes, I did see him run over all those kids. But you didn't. I did. And that's what you're gonna tell them, damn it. Oh no, Justin, they're breaking in. Ah! They're breaking in. It sounds like someone's breaking in. <laughs> You hit that B so good. It's just a storm, dick. Man, you fucking suck. I do. Hey, don't fucking throw a grenade at me. Oh, I died. <laughs> All right, we're going to take it super duper serious this time. Super and duper we're serial. we're going to camp on the catwalk together. How does that sound? Let's okay. actually get her done. Hold your goddamn hand. Like, Dude, since you don't have, like, neighbors, like, right next to you, just, like, thunderstorms, are they, like, a little bit scarier? Yeah, I don't have neighbors like super close to me. There's been a thunderstorm going on literally for the past 36 hours straight, like on and off. It's actually been freaking me out a little bit. It's like growing up, I had this stupid fear that like Bigfoot would be watching me from my windows. Like spawn from a bolt of electricity, <laughs> just sprints right towards your door, yeah. fucking tears it off. I had this fucking alive. fear of Bigfoot for some reason that he was gonna break in my house and fucking murder me. I fucking hate this game, dude. I really do. Okay, I hate you too. Rescue mission. You literally cannot escape death. Dude, if they hit you, you're just done. No, yeah, you're, it's like a... You ever... Uh, it, they're really inhumane, but you know those uh, sticky mouse traps where once the mouse steps on it, it just cannot move. It's like actually stuck yeah, there. Yeah, I it totally don't have a bunch of those in my attic. <laughs> well, I mean, um, <laughs> dude, I used to have those set up in my dad's basement when I was growing up all the time, and I'd go down there occasionally, and there'd be one stuck there, and it was dead before I ever even got to it because it would just fucking starve to death. You could just get stuck there and like starves to death. See, I, I it put- it doesn't die of exhaustion from trying to get out of there. I put a uh, rat poison in the middle of it. So that way they eat that and then that kills them and they can't move. So that way I can clean up their body. Yeah, that's slightly better. Mice are a little bit more tolerable. They're like half the size. Here, you know what? Um, how do you can counteract that? Get a snake and just release the snake in your house. <laughs> just a, just a fucking python <laughs> sli slithering around my house. <laughs> yeah. And then you won't One have to worry about my. It's the middle of the night. I'm like, oh, let me get a glass of water. I step on it and it fucking bites me and kills me. And then if you don't want the python in your house, you get like a fucking mongoose. An, an can, owl. Can, or that. 
control the python. That'd be so extra, dude. Just have an owl just post it up. He keeps the python in check. The python keeps the rats in check. I feel like actually a, a cat would be realistic, though. But then you have to have a I mean, gay-ass that... cat. Yeah. I'm not a huge cat guy. I already have a dog and a lizard and children. That's the worst. Last one. All right. Yeah, actually, I got two LMGs. I am chilling on the catwalk. Nice cock. That is <laughs> nice dick. <laughs> nice form. Yo, homie, your dick curves at a good angle. I'm going to die. Are you, Can are you, you just kidding me? not be ass? I was trying to help us. I was trying to link the fucking teleporter. Please don't die, man. I'm trying. Oh. I don't know how much more I can take. This is my fault. Oh no, it expired. Please get me. I have an MG42. Oh my god. Yes, you're get the up best. Get run, dog. Okay, there's like one zombie. <laughs> Yo, get up and run. Oh, there's one zombie. I'm playing Minecraft. Did you ever have that experience? Like, your mom just like, you're trying to play a video game or some shit. Your mom's just like, Oh, nah. yeah, dude. One time, there was an iconic time where my brother, his friend, and his two friends and I were doing the Shangri La Easter egg in her basement back in like, I don't even know, dude. Like, 2013, 2014. She got angry at us for God knows why. I don't remember. And then she just went into the garage where the router was, unplugged that <laughs> shit when we were on like one of the last steps. Never live that down. Yo, your mom's pretty based. She was like, F these kids. Unplug. Dude, you know how hard that Easter egg cool. is too, especially back then? Oh my god. <laughs> no, that was brutal. That was that was PTSD. <laughs> still, still get triggered from that. You walk yeah, into a like, garage, you have a panic attack. Or every time I load up Shane, I'm like, oh, God damn it. I remember back in like Modern Warfare 2 days, uh, if you were to get a fax, like for your printer and shit, your oh, uh, yeah. internet would go down. I remember or if you got a landline call, your internet goes down. Oh, that's shit. That's bad. So I'd be playing Modern Warfare 2, and the next thing I know, oh, getting kicked off. My mom's on the phone with her friend. <laughs> Dude, a fax machine. Oh, my God. I remember I used to have to use one of those every now and then to, like, send a form over for school or some shit. Like, it's just like a... What an ancient piece of technology. <laughs> so ancient. Like, what fucking boomer runs around the fax machine? Ah, uh, piss off, you twat! <laughs> you sound like Conjura. Hey, where's that goddamn mystery box at? Yeah, let's both go there so we can both get pinned and have to restart this challenge. Nah, we'll do run 14. We're good. If it's a dog round, I'll go, but otherwise, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm not. I, need a I gun. really want to do this for us. I really I'm kind of good this. at this game, so I'm not worried. Okay. Oh, I got a I'm ray gun! Oh, that's good. Don't die. I will. Do you remember the times where we used to play this game without actually recording it? <laughs> yeah. I barely, I really barely do. I No, that's not true at all, actually, but still, like, it feels like it's just been an eternity since then. Oh, my God. Good times, man. I used to remember coming home from school. Jumping on World of War, playing Darius until I went to bed. Times were simpler back then. You could say the N-word and get away with it. And you didn't have to be a fucking adult and, like, do adult shit. Yeah, you didn't have to do taxes, man. And does this shock you? Uh, what? The trap or no, the fucking wonder weapon? The oh. I'm gonna say yes would be the answer to both of those things. All the urge for penis is gone now. Would you rather have a gay son who's a bottom or an OnlyFans daughter? Dude, there's some OnlyFans girls that are making like an odd so, like millions amount. a month. It's it is not even fair. It's and really they want to be like, fair. oh, we can't walk at midnight. Like, bitch, you pay I rent with your dance, asshole. Man. Hey, what? Oh, I would be a trifling hoe if oh, I had dude. like a nice fucking If I was a woman, body. even if I was ugly, I feel like you could make it work. Just don't show your face. Yeah, as long as you got big old tits. Even not even that, dude. Belle Delphine. What? Hey. 
Oh yeah, because I don't have jug. <laughs> why do we, why are we both running around? <laughs> So obviously me and Tim suck at the game. So I went ahead and did it solo and my God, was it so much easier solo. I just camped by this trap the entire time and I would activate it and that would pretty much take care of almost the entire round. And I got lucky and got the ray gun and like one of the first two hits. So as long as you camp right here next to power, you don't open the door behind you, activate the trap constantly, you could skirt by round 20. I honestly think you could probably last until like round 25 right here or something. It's incredibly easy. So I guess it is true what they say. One is definitely better than two. That's not the saying at all, but that's what I'm going to go with. So that has been every single zombies achievement in World of War. If you guys want to see me do this for other games, let me know by leaving a comment and hitting that like button and subscribing and hitting that bell notification. That's going to be the video. Get out. Leave.